Little is known of the Russian blues origins. He probably does originate from Russia, his thick coat is undoubtedly that of a cat from colder climate, and he is thought about a natural breed, suggesting Matushka nature created him, not the handiwork of humans. The Russian blues development as a breed, however, took place mostly in Britain and Scandinavia, starting in the late 19th century, when revealing and breeding cats became a popular activity. The Russian Blue made his first appearance on the world stage of the cat fancy at an exhibition of cats held at London's Crystal Palace in 1875. Labeled an Archangel Cat, since he was said to be from the Russian island of Archangel, he competed versus other blue cats of varying types. A newspaper report of the show described the Russian Blue as extremely handsome and particularly furry, including they look primarily like the common wild grey rabbit. Other early names by which the breed was known were Maltese and Foreign Blue. A British cat fancier named Mrs. Carew Cox started importing the cats in 1890 and bred and showed them through the turn of the century. She described them as having short, silvery fur, big ears, wide-set eyes and lean faces, with sweet, intelligent personalities, in other words, much the same as the Russian Blue of today. In 1912, the cats were well enough developed that they could be displayed in a class of their own instead of being lumped together with other blue cats. The Second World War almost put an end to the breed. Extremely few cats endured the years of privation, and British and Scandinavian breeders relied on other breeds, mostly the Siamese and the British Blue, to help revive their bloodlines. Because of the Siamese influence, the cats developed a more severe appearance, and the texture of their coat changed. It took years to bring the breed back to its initial look. That was accomplished by combining British bloodlines, which emphasized plush, silvery coats, and Scandinavian bloodlines, which were understood for producing cats with bright green eyes and flat profiles. The result was a Russian blue of moderate type seen today. Russian blues were first imported to the United States in 1900, however it was until after World War II that American breeders began to develop their own lines from cats imported in 1947. Today they are popular show cats in addition to companions to those who know the secret of their sweet beauty. Are Russian blue cats really hypoallergenic? According to Pet MD, hypoallergenic breeds, consisting of the Russian blue, aren't technically non-allergenic the lessened amount of dander and other irritants they produce isn't enough to activate allergies to a noticeable level in the majority of people. How much does a Russian blue cat cost? The average cost of Russian blue kittens in the United States is in between $400 and $600. Most so-called Russian blues at shelters remain in fact simply domestic short hairs, as cats of such an expense would not be abandoned. Personality of Russian Blue Kitten The Russian Blue has a credibility as a gentle, quiet cat, somewhat shy, however do not get the wrong concept. This cat might have a reserved nature, but he likes to play, being especially fond of retrieving, and enjoys jumping or reaching high places where he can study people and situations at his leisure before making up his mind about whether he wants to get involved. Guests will not receive his instant attention and might never see him unless he decides they deserve his notice, but toward relatives, especially his favorite person, he is ever faithful, following them through your home and even riding on a shoulder. The Russian Blue is a sensitive cat who doesn't like to be ignored and will be hurt if he doesn't receive the exact same quantity of love he offers. Lack of attention can trigger him to end up being anxious or fearful. While the Russian Blue likes your company, he is capable of entertaining himself throughout the day while you are at work. Unlike some active, intelligent breeds, he is not damaging however moves through your house with the lithe grace of a Russian ballerina. When you are at house, his subtle sense of humor and manual dexterity will never ever stop working to entertain. Just make certain you laugh with him, not at him. He has a strong sense of self-worth and doesn't like being teased. This is a cat who does finest in a quiet, steady environment. He doesn't like modification, and it's especially crucial to him that meals show up on time. Count on him to be a devoted alarm clock in the morning, not so you do not miss work however so he does not miss out on a meal. If you take the time to develop a relationship with a Russian Blue, your benefit will be a deep bond with this loving cat. Are Russian Blue cats rare? They're not the only blue cats in the world. 
While the Chartreux is thought about to be a rare cat breed, the Russian Blue can be found in abundance. However there are in fact two other breeds that are Blue too, the Korat of Thailand and the British Short Hair. How can I tell if my Blue Russian Cat is real? Nearly all Russian Blues share some traits, a short, dense coat, uniform gray fur, which breeders and fanciers call blue, with silvery tipping, and green eyes. If your feline friend does not precisely match this description, he's probably a domestic short-haired cat. Health of a Russian Blue Both pedigreed cats and mixed-breed cats have varying incidences of health problems that may be genetic in nature. The Russian Blue is typically healthy, nevertheless. An owner's primary issue will most likely be this cat's hearty Russian appetite, which can turn him from sleek to stout in no time. Care of a Russian Blue Kitten The Russian Blue's dense coat needs to be combed twice a week to get rid of dead hair and distribute skin oils. Brush the teeth to prevent periodontal disease. Daily oral hygiene is best, but weekly brushing is better than nothing. Cut the nails every couple of weeks. A bath when the cat is shedding will assist to get rid of excess hair faster. Keep the Russian Blue's litter box spotlessly clean. He is very specific about bathroom hygiene. It's a good idea to keep a Russian Blue as an indoor-only cat to protect him from diseases spread by other cats, attacks by pets or coyotes, and the other threats that face cats who go outdoors, such as being hit by an automobile. Russian Blues who go outdoors likewise run the risk of being stolen by someone who wants to have such a beautiful cat without spending it. What is the distinction in between a Russian Blue and a British Blue cat? The British Shorthair is a low-maintenance cat, happy to unwind alone while you're out at work. The Russian Blue is also an extremely laid-back cat. She's playful however not provided to drama or destructiveness. This breed is gentle, quiet and loving. Coat Color and Grooming The Russian Blue's elegant yet muscular body led one cat judge to declare him the Doberman Pincher of cats. He has what's called the semi-foreign physique, meaning it is moderate in shape, falling someplace between the short, compact body of breeds such as Persians and the sleek angles of oriental breeds such as the Siamese. The Cat Fanciers Association breed standard for the Russian Blue calls for him to have a head that is a smooth, medium-sized wedge shape with a blunt muzzle. The broad wedge of the head and its flat skull are typically described as cobra-like, although that is much too hazardous a description for this sweet-natured cat. Regal is possibly a much better term. Large ears are wide at the base with pointed ideas, the interior lined with thin, clear skin, and rounded vivid green eyes are set broad apart. A long, slender neck segues into high shoulder blades and a fine-boned body that is firm and muscular, covered with a short, thick double coat with a plush texture frequently described as similar to that of a seal or beaver. If you were to run your fingers through a Russian Blue's coat, the patterns they made would remain up until they were petted smooth. The body is supported by long, fine-boned legs set on small, little rounded paws with pads that are a pinky lavender or mauve shade. The tail is long but in proportion to the body. The Russian Blue stands out for his coat color. To the uninformed, he may look gray, but in cat reveal terms he is an even, bright blue with silver-tipped hairs that make him appear to glisten. Some Russian blue kittens are born with ghost stripes, a reminder of the tabby gene that all cats bring, even if it isn't expressed in their coat, however these typically fade, leaving the cat with a strong blue coat of maturity. You may think that a Russian blue would only be available in blue and in CFA that is true, however other cat associations have more liberal breed standards. In Australia and New Zealand, the cats are called Russians and can be found in white and black as well as the traditional blue. The American Cat Fanciers Association permits black Russians. Children and other pets Russian blues have a tolerant nature towards kids who treat them kindly and respectfully. They will even tolerate the clumsy pats given by toddlers, as if they acknowledge that no harm is meant, and if necessary they will walk away or climb up out of reach to get away being bonked on the head. That said, the patient and gentle Russian Blue need to always be protected from rough treatment, so always supervise really young children when they want to pet the cat. The Russian Blue is also accepting of other animals, including pets, as long as they aren't chased or alarmed by them. 
Introduce pets slowly and in regulated circumstances to ensure that they discover to get along together.